Hi, welcome back to Naples. Well, Napoli might have a 17-point cushion still at the top of the Serie A table, but they were absolutely played off the park tonight by Milan, who picked up a 4-0 win away from home at the Maradona. And joining us now live pitch side, what a joy it is to have Rafael Leal, last season's league MVP with us. Rafael, I mean, congratulations, first thank of all. You, you. you had a brace tonight, a 4-0 win. I mean, could things have gone much better for you? Yeah, very happy for for um, for the team for the victory against a tough uh, a tough team, um, and uh, I think we we did very well, and uh, we have to to keep this this way. Yeah, I, I, last season you played in the four three two one. This then you changed yeah. a couple of weeks ago, one yeah. month ago, and now you changed back again. Yeah. Which one do you prefer to play in? Which one do you feel you get more opportunity in, in front of the goal? Of course, I feel more comfortable playing this uh, in this four two four two three one. Uh, stay in the left, uh, wait for a ball, and uh, make movement inside as well. And uh, because uh, sometimes when I'm when I'm the center. I think I don't have space to turn around and uh, and do my my game, so I prefer to to play in this in this in this place. Hi Rafa, he just stole stole my my question, but <laughs> I, I have another one for you. Yeah. Today I, I don't know. I, I ask you, was it more down to the system or the motivation? They they was very high in, in your. Yeah, game? yeah, both because uh, we heard some some people talk a lot uh, about us uh, in the bad way. And uh, and play against Naples as well, uh, and the stadium as well. Uh, we knew we we have to do a great match to to beat them. Yeah. Thank you. You definitely did that. Uh, how high is your confidence now? Looking ahead, let's just take a look at some of your moments in the game today because it felt like Napoli they just couldn't get out of second gear, could they? They were a step behind the ball. You linked up so nicely all match long with Brahim Diaz. How did it play out for you? Uh, I, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> the Milan fans are just so excited above you to see the Milan Corva. I, didn't, I didn't get it, the, the question. We're just looking at some of uh, your highlights here. You linking up with Brahim Diaz okay. all match long. I uh, mean, there was just some some brilliant moments. Yeah, he's, uh, he's a impressive. He's a impressive player as well. Uh, we link each other very well, and uh, it's a pleasure to play with uh, with my teammates like this. It's, it's easy. And here's the fans that uh, were just chanting your name a second ago. We know that you've got two more games coming up against Napoli in the Champions League in the quarterfinals. What does this do for your mentality now moving forward, playing so dominantly tonight, knowing that you've got those games coming up in just two, in for, under two weeks? Yeah, for us, this was uh, our first final. And uh, I think we did well. And uh, the next matches against, against them will be a different, a different games. But uh, we will be prepared to, to play against them and try to, 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 to pass the round. Rafa, this was the, the would you say, the, one of the best halves, that, uh, best games that Milan played uh, yeah, for me in a long time. Of what, what could you say is the difference between, you know, maybe in the beginning of 2023, very shaky start, and the difference now looked for me like a uh, big difference in confidence, and all the players look like they play in tight spaces and with a lot of confidence with the ball. Yeah, uh, I think uh, first of all was we changed the system because we we wanted to be more consistent and uh, different different way, and uh, when we get there, the, I think uh, the the coach changed, and uh, after I think the our players play better and they, they feel more comfortable like this. It was a big win as well because that three points puts you back in the top four as well, back in, in the race for Champions League for next season as well. Do you feel like in a way this can be a bit of a catalyst now and a big confidence boost, a momentum boost moving forward, not only with Champions League but a tight race now for Europe? Of course, uh, win this game, uh, give us more confidence and to, to reach our goals to, to be uh, close to the top. Well, thank you so much for joining us. I'm sure it's Bye. going to be a very pleasant trip back to Milan for you. And I know the fans are enjoying you as well.